Although the suburb of Bertrams, located on the eastern edge of Joburg CBD, may not look like much, hidden away are some fascinating locations of interest. It's just a matter of taking a short left to explore. Joburg today speaks to Craig de la Hop, who provides us with an insight on the suburb's history. Bertrams as a whole was um, for some of the middle management of the miners back in the day. So that's why you've got some of these nice little mining houses, not quite as big as the Park Town ones, but middle management houses. And um, so it had something to do with the mining, and it's also actually known as Old Town. This is one of the oldest parts of town in Joburg, which is quite fascinating. So hopefully that's something that can catch on one day. He also shares with us his take on business in the area and his vision for the future. It's mainly about the whole street. This whole street is about the village on Freer, and the background of that is the Skills Village 2030. And the other side is an old company called Party Design, and that is all about events and decor. So the Skills Village side was about creating cooperatives within the event value chain and through that having independent mechanisms within the eventing system. So when they're big jobs, we can have all these little um, cooperatives providing whatever service is needed. Business hasn't all been easy because the skills development side does take a lot of resources and it's taken a lot of energy and time. Recently we started turning more of the spaces into venues. So we have a theatre venue, we have a training centre, we've got the firehouse which is a really great special venue and um, we actually have 220 individual little spaces here if you have to count all of them. And we've got this amazing warehouse filled with 35 year collection of props and um, we've got all the things you need for events. It's been an incubator for some of our resident artists here for 15 years and what's amazing is if you walk around the village you can see some of their art artworks and see how they've grown in the last 10 or 15 years. What's interesting with rejuvenation of spaces is generally it starts with the, the artists and then parties and then the hip crowd who sort of claim that they were the first ones there and then the masses follow. In 20 years from now this place is abundant with people and activities and people coming in for training, people coming in to spend money, people supporting the people that are here who require the service. So it's about this um, street finally thriving. I'm Leroy Viaggi for Joburg Today.